Hello everyone, this is Bhaskar Roy from Workado and today we are going to talk about workflows in Slack. Slack is a great tool for you to communicate with everyone and get things done. And when you combine workflows, your business processes like sales, marketing, support, HR and finance and being able to do that in Slack, it becomes a very powerful tool. Uh, the possibilities are pretty much endless. Today we are going to look at a very specific workflow which is around support ticket escalation and see how that can be enabled through Slack. So let's jump straight into this. We have installed this product called WorkBot. WorkBot is a platform bot that enables you to build workflows uh, in Slack. Um, it's completely customizable and it can work across pretty much all your apps. In this specific instance of WorkBot, we have configured it to work with Jira, Salesforce, ServiceNow, Zendesk, etc. Now let's start with the scenario that we talked about, which is being able to handle a support escalation. Let's start with creating a ticket. Um, here you go. Once we enter create ticket, it starts creating a ticket in Zendesk, the support application that, that is used, prompts you for the required fields. In this case, we say that the ticket is urgent. There is some big issue. And then the description, it will prompt me and we say that, you know, something to resolve ASAP. Enter customer name. In this case, let's say we enter gene point. And you know, the thing is, in this case, it will go check with Salesforce to see if this is what the sta status is of this particular customer. And then based on that, it can prompt you to say, hey, would you like to escalate this ticket? Since it's an urgent ticket, let's say that, yeah, let's go ahead, escalate this to engineering. It can automatically create a Jira ticket. Um, and then what you notice over here is it has also done some post in a channel called escalated tickets, which is something that the escalation team monitors. So they see this ticket come in, uh, ticket 34, the customer name, and they also get some data from Salesforce, right? The total expected opportunity value, the number of opportunities open. Seems like there is a 150K deal being worked on. Let's actually try to resolve this as soon as possible. So let's create a Slack channel with the required people in and work through it. Let's say, for example, call this ticket 34 it is resolution. And it will go ahead, create the channel, like you see over here. And then it will prompt me as to which all users we would like to bring in to this specific channel. Let's say I want to invite people from the platform group, invites the product managers, prompts me to see if there are other folks that I need to invite. Okay, those are the guys that I wanted involved. And so now let's go start working on the ticket. As you can see, I didn't have to do anything in this channel. It automatically populated the Zendesk ticket and the Jira ticket so that the, the folks coming into this channel have full context. Um, now let's click on this to see what the issue is all about. You can pull the context from Zendesk and other places. We see that, okay, this is the issue. What's the issue number, etc. We can go back to Slack and say, you know what, this is actually a known bug let's uh, work on it later and as you can see I, all i did was add comments straight from here and i can say known issue getting resolved in two days now it goes ahead adds the comment in to jira itself this particular comment got added to jira and since this ticket is now resolved let's now go ahead and close this ticket close issue, then it will prompt me for the issue ID, which is, okay, and then it will go ahead, close the Jira ticket, but wait, also understands what's the corresponding Zendesk ticket, close that ticket as well. It understood that all the tickets associated with this ticket resolution or this escalation channel is now done, prompts me, do you want to archive this channel? Yeah, let's go ahead and archive it. Don't need this channel anymore. It archives this channel. I close this channel and it's done. And the great part is now the person who created the ticket also gets a notification that 
the issue was resolved. It also added the comment in of the Jira so that they knew what the resolution was. And this is what Workbot can enable. It can enable you to do any kind of workflows uh, in Slack. Thank you.